Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. I want to apologize first of all because I've been MIA and I did not upload video as I want to but I finally got the time to make this video and upload it. So this video is going to be my go-to everyday makeup look. So this is the look that I've been using pretty much all the time if I'm going out or just, you know, if I'm going out or just hang out with friends or at work. This is the look that I just throw on my face and I'm good to go. This is very easy, very simple. You can recreate this look. You can change up the look. Alright, so for this look, I'm going to be using the Kat Von D Monarch Eyeshadow Palette. I'm also going to be using these individual shadows from Shea Moisture Cosmetics and I think it's called Cassandra. I also already primed my eyes so don't worry, didn't forget that because primer is important so don't forget that because I didn't. So the first shadow that I'm taking is this shadow from the palette. It's called Anthemology. It's like a matte yellow, light yellow color. So I take that as a base. Next, I'm taking Cassandra, this pretty shimmery pinkish color. And actually for this shadow, you have to spray your brush with a MAC Fix Plus. But since I don't have that, I'm just going to use my fingers because I think it picks up the shadows better than just using a dry brush. So I'm just going to use my finger. And I'm pretty much just packing the shadows all over my lid as much as I can. And some days, if I don't feel like putting on makeup, I just use this one shadow and I'm good to go. Next, I'm taking this brush to apply a light brown shade from the palette. And I think it's called Killing Jar. Oops, clumsy me. And I apply that color onto the outer part of my crease and kind of like dragging it down to the inner part of my crease. gives you a nice transition color and then I take a smaller brush I don't know what it's called and I'm taking this darker brown shade <clears throat> and apply that onto my crease but this time only on the outer part Just to create a little depth. And then I'm taking a clean blending brush and without adding more colors, I'm just going to blend everything so there is no harsh line. And I feel like I want to add a little bit more warmth to my eyes, so I'm taking this burnt orange shadow and I'm just applying that onto my crease and blending it out. That shadow is my favorite 
shadow in the palette, and it's called um, Dad Deadhead. <laughs> And then I'm going back to Cassandra because I just can't get enough of this color. It's so pretty. And apply that to my lid again, to the center part of my lid. And then I'm taking a smaller brush and apply that to the inner corners of my eye. And then I'm taking this angled brush to apply this dark brown shade to the third half of my lower lash line. Alright, so I'm already done with my one eye. I didn't put any liner, but you can definitely do that. I just curl my lashes and put on some mascara but because my lashes is very short and I want a longer lashes I like to use this mascara base from Lancome it creates like a fiber that will voluminize and lengthen your lashes which I really love I mean who doesn't love long lashes right And the mascara I'm using um, today is this um, Maybelline Push Up Drama Mascara. This is actually my first time trying out this product and so far so good. And I'm also applying that to my lower lashes. And then I'm taking this nude eyeliner from Sephora and applying that to my waterline. I love this step because it makes my eyes look bigger and brighter, especially in the morning. And now back to the face. Before this video, I already did my foundation and a little bit of contouring. So now I'm going to set everything but my under eyes with this translucence powder from Lancome. I also already set my under eyes, so I don't need to set that. So now I'm going to bronze my face a little bit more and I'm taking this Bobbi Brown bronzing powder in the shade Natural One and I'm just applying that to areas where I contour my face earlier. I will also have a video about how I contour my face and my foundation routine coming soon so don't worry girl, I got you. Now I'm taking my dirty Naked Flush palette and we're gonna do a little bit of highlighting and put on some blush and then we're done. And I'm using this flat brush to highlight my face.
And for the blush, I'm taking my big fluffy kabuki brush and applying this rosy plum color to my cheek. Here I'm just cleaning this brush so I can blend everything so there is no harsh line and everything is blended very well. Now I'm taking my stripped down lip liner and combining that with my Maybelline Nude Nuance. And this is the final look. I hope you guys enjoy this video and if you like it, give me a thumbs up. I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye!